moment of silence. The moment of silence we just shared marks the very moment 20 years ago that American Airlines Flight 11 flew into the North Tower of the World Trade Center. My name is Mike Lowe, and my daughter Sarah Elizabeth Lowe was a flight attendant on that plane. These 20 years have felt like both a long time and a short time, and as we recite the names of those we lost, my memory goes back to that terrible day when it felt like an evil specter had descended on our world. But it was also a time when many people acted above and beyond the ordinary. Beginning with the actions of the flight crews, like Sarah, and the passengers on the four flights, the individuals in the towers, the professionals of the fire and police, and later the volunteers who helped work on the pile sensitive to recovering our loved ones' remains. They helped pull us through the darkest days of our lives. In the last 20 years, my family and I have at times known unbearable sorrow and disbelief about the lives that would never be. <clears throat> years we have filled with speaking out on my daughter's behalf <clears throat> and calling on many more precautions, and also for the history to be remembered not as numbers and a date, but the faces of ordinary people, people who looked a lot like Sarah. At the first memorial ceremony, my wife Bobby and I stood here with thousands of family members, right in the midst of a gray and black world of destroyed buildings. Today, this is a quiet place of memory. The gleaming 9-11 Museum holds a sacred repository for our loved ones' remains. And the still brightly stories of all the sons and daughters, the siblings, husbands and wives, grandparents and friends. As we carry these 20 years forward, I find sustenance in a continuing appreciation for all of those who's, <clears throat> who rose to be more than ordinary people and a father's pride in his daughter's selfless acts in the last moments of her life, acting with heroic calm to help those in the air and those on the ground, a legacy from Sarah that burns like an eternal flame. 